Hello and welcome. You are watching Don Bosco Media Network. This is Deepika Lingdo bringing to you the Salesian news across the globe. The Don Bosco School of Arts and Crafts Takuru Movement recently celebrated its 50th anniversary in the Marconi district of Montevideo, Uruguay. To find out more about this charismatic Salesian presence, we interviewed Beatrice Bright, the project's coordinator. Salesian missionaries with St. Augustine's Parish, located in the Warzog community within Freetown, Sierra Leone, have partially completed construction of a new church thanks to donor funding provided by Salesian Missions, the U.S. development arm of the Salesian of Don Bosco. As the number of parishioners and the size of community have increased, Salesian missionaries embarked on a multi-phase project to expand their outgrown church. At the beginning of 2021, with the feast day of Don Bosco already on the horizon, the vacation campaign of Salation of the Spain St. James Major SSM province arrives in search of heroes, a proposal that comes from the call made by Pope Francis during the pandemic's hardest days. Ordinary people, often forgotten people, who do not appear in newspapers and magazine headlines, nor on the grand catwalks of the latest show but who, without any doubt, are in these very days writing the decisive events of our time. On the occasion of the 50th anniversary of the founding of the Don Rua Philosophical Institute based in Dalat, Vietnam, Saturday, January 2, 2021, at 20.21 20, p.m., the Bishop of the Diocese of Dalat, Monsieur Dominic Nguyen Van Ma, presided over the inauguration rites of a new pastoral building. From January 2nd to 4th, the School for Animators to be Moved, Emotionally and Committed of the Salesian Youth Movement SYM, of Salesian Don Bosco and the Daughters of Mary Help of Christians of the Buenos Aires region took place online. 114 animators participated in the formation event, accompanied by the managers of various zones. On 7th to 8th January, the St. Francis de Sales Institute of Philosophy of the Salesian Vice Province of Haiti, HAI, organized the 12th edition of the Cultural Morning. Two days of reflections, conferences and debates for the students and lay people of the institute, this time centered on the theme, the principle of goodness for an active and honest citizenship. The event was attended by Monsieur Patrick Aris, who led a study of the concept of goodness, Father Gideon Jean Robin, SDB, professor and author of numerous books, who presented The Citizen and the City, the commitment of the Christian in the construction of our common home in the light of Pope Francis's encyclical Fratelli Tutti, and in conclusion, Father Pierre Ernest Basil, SDB, director of the Institute. The Salesian Mission Office of Madrid, Misiones Salesianas, has allocated funds to the Salesian Vice Province of Africa Great Lakes AGL for the purchase of a bus to be given to young students of the Don Bosco Vocational Training Center of Palabec. The vehicle was donated to help students in their various initiatives and to give them the opportunity to carry out recreational activities away from the settlement. The Salesians do their utmost for the well-being of the young refugees of Palabec and that is why, in addition to training them in various professions, they also fight to offer them a better life through education, social well-being, evangelization, development, sustenance of the community and despite the difficulties thanks to the support of Mission Salesianas and many benefactors, the young people still manage to smile and be happy. The call of Jesus to be fishers of men, Matthew 4.19, in the Don Bosco way, were heeded by four from Karnataka and eight from Kerala for the province of Bangalore this year. The Sacred Heart Province of Bangalore, Inc. is blessed with 12 new priests in the latter half of 2020 and at the beginning of 2021. Though the current pandemic protocol laid down restrictions, the ordination to the priesthood of these deacons was solemnized the best way possible, attended by Salesians, relatives and well-wishers. Ninth January 2021 was a great day for Don Bosco English Medium School, Coarmunda, as it witnessed the blessing of the school building and the installation of the statue of St. John Bosco in front of the school building by Rev. Father Jose Matthew, Provincial of the Inn. 
in the presence of Reverend Father Biju Abraham, Provincial Economist, and Mr. Ramesh Kerketa, former MLA, who were given traditional welcome by washing of hands and showering of flower petals. So, viewers, that is all we have for you today. Until we meet again, thank you for watching.